The old saying that April showers bring May flowers is anything but true for Dawn Silva. Days like today, I'm always, uh, you know, particularly concerned. Yeah. For her, even the slightest bit of rain puts this mother of four on edge. And I'm in trouble if it, if it continues. Good job. Butterfly? But her life on this quiet cul-de-sac near this tranquil stream wasn't always bad. Oh, bubble guppies. We'd have barbecues in the front lawn, and wiffle ball tournaments. And now I'm here by myself. What time is it? A lot. What do you want to watch? Come here. On the night of August 21st of 2011, that tranquil stream in the backyard became a raging river and an ocean of trouble. We had 15 minutes to get out before the water came gushing through. It was like watching a train wreck. And just one week later, Hurricane Irene threw the knockout punch. And what we didn't lose on the 21st, we lost everything on the 28th, and I mean everything. Whew, gone. Everything, including friends and neighbors. I can't even explain to you how mentally it messes you up that in a blink of an eye, everything you ever owned is gone. It's not like a fire where you know what you rebuild and you replace. With, with a flooding problem, you know that it's just gonna happen and happen and happen again. What's that? Hmm? But for everything she's lost, she may have gained a little as well. We keep this as a constant reminder of that's how high the water was. At the end of the day, you gotta pick yourself up, put your big girl panties on and deal with it. The whole entire thing has to be gutted. There's a new sense of purpose. I'm fighting, I'm fighting for what's fair and what's right. To fight against a river hell-bent on taking over. You can't believe that they built houses here. And a system that's done nothing to prevent it. We have a letter from the Army Corps of Engineers saying it's not a solvable problem. All to maintain a sense of stability in an otherwise unstable situation. Scotty, what are you doing in school today? I need help. For her family. <laughs> you know, your job as a parent is to make them feel safe, and it's gonna happen again. You okay? Okay? Because tomorrow calls for more rain, and Dawn Silva will be walking through the abandoned yards of her old friends and neighbors. Where it's making its new path to keep a watchful eye on that ever-expanding river. A foot wide by a foot deep. And pray that her ever-decreasing faith in our system finally comes to help. In Howell Township, New Jersey, Brian Johnston, Neighborhood Journal.